Welcome back, Bad Boy MTG. What do we have here? Dark Ascension for that sweet ass. Oh, I love the older shit. This isn't too old. What, like five years? We got a date on this pup? 2012. Five years. So, welcome to Dark Ascension. You know what I should have done? I should have pulled up a list on these cards. Find out what's valuable in this set. But, that's all fun because I like when you guys fill in the blanks for me. I know a few cards that are worth some hits in here. Maybe we'll pull them, maybe we won't. But, either way, let's tear that ass off. Oh, I like how these packs look, too. We've got some Soren action, got some werewolf shit up in here. Got this dude, don't know what that dude's about. But he looks pretty badass. Alright. Wish me luck as I dive up into the packs. Alright, here we go. Dark Ascension, round one. Fight. Alright, let's get it on. How's everyone doing today? I wish I could open these quicker. I really wish I could open them quicker. Oh, so that's the symbol. Now I know. Tragic slip. There we go. I'm going to pull this up a little bit without making my camera drag everywhere and get all stupid. Give me a moment here. Shit got a little cray cray. Okay, there we go. Get this going. Only to the good stuff. Get that focus spot right there. Cool. Relentless scabs. I know some relentless scab suckers from back in the day. Them hoes wouldn't leave me alone, daddy. We got two of these? That's weird. Chalice of life. So I guess this has the flips up in them, huh? If uh, if I pack it with the flips, man. So we got the flips up in here, dude. That's cool, man. Hope I get something cool here. Artful dodge. Love ya. As you know. Oh, Immerwolf. That's a sweet ass card if you don't know Immerwolf. It's got Intimidate. Other wolf and werewolf creatures you control get plus one, plus one. Non human werewolves you control can't transform. Play a play a predator ooze. I'm not seeing anything too sexy here. That's okay. Calm down. Calm down. That's cool. That's cool right there. Not sure the value on it, but that's cool. But then that's really cool. And a foil. So we got two rares. <laughs> oh, I forget about this craziness. So we got two rares. The Immerwolf, and a foil altar of the lost. I don't even give a fuck what it does. I don't care what it do, all I know is I pulled it. So there we go. That's cool. I like Immerwolf. He just made my day. He really did. All right, let's put that aside. Cool. Oh, we are getting sloppy over here. Yes, we are. A little bit of sorting and organization is the route to go. Come on, give me something nasty. Give me something. Oh, another wrap for Dodge. Should have opened this box before I went to my LGS. Would have saved me about a buck or two. <laughs> it's funny. It's funny because it's true. I could have saved a buck or two. Oh, my gosh. Sudden disappearance. Exile all non-land permanents. Target player controls. Return the exiled cards to the battlefield under their owner's control at the beginning of the next end step. I could see a use for that. But with five, it's a little crazy. Ooh, Chosen of Malkov. Damn, and another one. Uh, Favor of the Woods. Cool. Loving foils. You guys know I love my foils. What's your favorite foil? And not your favorite card. Because there's a difference here between your favorite card and your favorite foil. See, my favorite card is completely different because I like it for different reasons. My favorite foil... I think it just looks sexy as hell. I think it's like, wow. Like, when you see that foil, it's, it's, it, it, there's certain areas that maybe it's the eyes of the card that glow, you know? Maybe, uh, that's a really bad card. Maybe, I'll say it every time I see it too. Um, maybe it's like, sh it's got some glossy nipples like that fucking sword, baby. Bam! That's what I'm fucking getting it at. Woo! Oh, I love my planeswalkers. Oh my god, I almost choked myself. <coughs> oh, such a good, such a fun pool. Oh, we have fun. We have fun here. Yes, we do. So we got Soren Lord of Innistrad. That's sweet. Someone's gonna comment. Dude just went fucking bonkers and lost it over a $5 card. Yep, I sure did. Welcome to Bad Boy. <laughs> Soren, Lord of Innistrad. I'll read this guy for you. For those of you who don't know Soren, let's uh, get quaint, shall we? Put a plus one, plus one vampire creature token with lifelink onto the battlefield. 
For minus two, you get an emblem with creatures you control. Get plus one, plus zero. First minus six, destroy up to three target creatures and or other planeswalkers. Return each card put into a graveyard this way to the battlefield under your control. Not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. That puppy, we all know where that's going. That's going in the patron. Of course. Up for grabs. Up for grabs. Hell yeah. That is awesome. Lingering Souls, not bad. That is freaking awesome, guys. Love a nice pool. Love a nice pool. So anyway, back to talking about what's your favorite foil. I would like to know what your favorite foil is. I'm not going to disclose mine right now. I'll just have to show you in one video. Maybe it's that good. Maybe it's mind-blowingly expensive. Maybe it's the cheapest card you've ever seen. Maybe you've pulled one and got upset and ripped it up. Maybe. These are all maybes we have. But I want to know what your favorite foil card is. For whatever reason. That would be cool as a foil. I'd like that as a foil. I want to see that. Maybe I could pull one. Maybe I could pull one, baby. That'd be sick if I get it right now. I would just I would just seriously take a dump if I just pulled that right now. I'd be like, oh, and just rip my egg. Okay. Tragic Slip Foil. That's sweet. Hell yeah. Look at that shit. That's an awesome card, just saying. Target creature gets minus one, minus one until end of turn. That creature gets minus uh, 13, minus three until end of turn if a creature died this turn. Fucking sweet. Pardon my French. Pardon my French. I'm going to clean it up. We're getting a little out of control here, Mr. Moss, with that swearing. My son watches your stuff, and I don't appreciate that kind of behavior. Well, ma'am, I'm sorry. But that's the way shit goes. Woo! All right, let's calm it down. Let's calm it down. What are we going to get? What are we going to get? What are we going to get? Oh, I need that as a foil so bad. Ugh. I hope I pull one. That that would make my day if I did. Boosh. Increasing ambition. Zombie token. No foil. No foilage. No foilage. That's all right. We cannot hit a home run every time we're up to bat. It's just not thinking realistically, guys. It's just not going to happen that way. So anyway, but yeah, love to hear your favorite foil. And it, when's, did you ever open any Ascension? Have you ever opened any Ascension? I'll tell you one thing, this is the first time I've ever opened Ascension. I got back into magic shortly after this entire block, so try to slip again. That looks cool. That would be a cool, a cool foil too. But I really want the other one. I really want that other one. Secrets of the Dead, Shattered, Curse of Echoes. Curse of Bulk. That's what that says to me. That's who we want to pull. That's the money card right there, is that player. We find that homie up in here. We hit like 20 bucks. He's pretty He's pretty badass. Soul Caesar. Soul Sizer. Ghastly Haunting. Those are cool. That'd be a cool... Uh... Do they have foil flip cards? Because then both sides would be foil, right? I don't even know if they do. Do they make foil flips? I don't... Oh, I should have looked that up. I don't even know. Honestly, I didn't even know these were flips. Shows how much I know about the Dark Ascension. All right, let's see what we got. That's weird. Did I open this pack backwards? Sure did. Welcome to Joy Moss. All right. Or that cat. I want to. Oh, I still want that. Fires of Undeath. I want that in foil so bad. All right. Grim Flowering Mystical Revival Dungeon Geists. Pretty slick. I'm not sure all the money cards in here, so bear with me. Scorned Villager. All right, okay, okay. Try to rock and roll a little quicker here. Maybe we can make this under 20 minutes. What do you think? What do you think? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Hackling Fiends. Grim Backwoods. That might be a buck. Can't remember. Any land has potential to do something. Sacrifice a creature, draw a card. That one probably doesn't have that much potential, though. Afflicted Deserter. Yeah, Gr Grim Backwoods, I would have to say, you're not in the $2 or more range. If you are, I'd, I'd, I'd be mind blown. I would be simply mind blown. Let's get right here so the background doesn't look terrible. There we go. So, I guess I'm thinking, and I think a lot, guys. I'm thinking about putting um, another commander deck together. But this one, like, of course, abiding by all the rules and everything and legal purposes. Counter Lash, not a great card. Um, and uh, it's going to be pretty gnarly. 
it's gonna kick some booties, let me say. At least I'd like to think it's gonna kick some ass. I don't know, when I, when I put a deck together, uh, I mean, my dragons were a fuck around kind of deck, you know? So I was just kind of having fun. First time I, you know, thought I'd put it just a random. My, my, my son's like, why don't you just throw up, uh, put your dragons up there, see what they think of that. I'm like, well, you know, kind of only use it against you to mess around with, so. Curse of Misfortunes, I guess I could. That's cool. A little aura curse for that sweet ass. Any card you want to read, just go ahead and pause it at that point. Because I'm trying to zip along here. So yeah, I threw up the dragons. Like literally regurgitated them out of my mouth. Kind of weird, but you know, shit happens. Bone to ash, and uh, what you saw is what you got there with them. The Tharaban Doomsday. I see you a lot in repacks, so I'm assuming you ain't worth shit. You could be worth something, though. Who knows? I like that zombie art, though. Check that zombie art out. It's pretty cool, huh, guys? I dig it. Dark Ascension. These are fun. Any pack's fun, but, like, the flips are fun. Kind of. I just... Are there a, Okay, again, I'll repeat myself. If you haven't answered yet, is there flip foils? Or am I going to find out on my own here? Who knows? Lost in the Woods. Lost in the Woods. Excellent. Oh, I had to flip it right away. That's a sweet-looking uh, foil, though. Look at that. Sightless Ghoul. That's cool. With Undying Ability. If only it was one less to cast. I would be up on that shit. Like a white on a rice. I'm assuming Lost in the Woods is not worth anything. I'm going to take a wild crack at it and then say it ain't worth shit. I could be wrong. Ugh. Why do I... I'm not good at packs. I remember way back in the day when I opened packs, they were easier to open. I know there's some arguments out there. You didn't even open them back then, because then they were so hard to open. Well, that's because of time. Time really put a seal on it. There is another foil. Uh, Beguiler of Wills. Something just flashed on my screen. I don't know what the hell that was. Uh, gain control of target creature with power less than or equal to the number of creatures you control. On one one. That's kind of a cool card. And a scor uh, scorned villager. How about that? That's sweet. That's a cool little wizard. Not sure how valuable it is, but it's pretty cool. As are you. I think you're pretty cool. You know why? Because you're watching this. And that is awesome. Yay. In the description, you guys can find me on Facebook. We could be buddies. We could be best friends for life. Archangel's Light. I know that's not worth shit. But... Let's see what it does. Maybe it is worth something. You gain two life for each card in your graveyard. Then shuffle your graveyard into your library. That's cool. That's a lot of life you could possibly gain. Oh, flipped it. <laughs> Clinging Mists. Foils are always, always so sweet. Uh, so I'm kind of nervous here. That was another mythic right there. That's three mythics we have. So either this is going to be filled with mythics and we're going to get like six. Or this box is going to be bossed and, and we're done with mythics right now. Not sure which one's the case. Why am I struggling so real to open these? Maybe I gotta be more violent. I don't wanna be violent though. That would be a sweet foil too. I'm gonna give me one of those. All right, moving along here. Diagraph Captain. Hell Rider. Cool, cool. Whenever creatures you control attacks, uh, whenever creatures you control attacks, Hell Rider deals one damage to defending player. Nice. That can be, that could do something. Whenever a creature you control attacks, Hell Rider deals one damage to defending player. That could be a real... Why is that not a more valuable card? You can just flood it with tokens and then swing and then the dude fucking dies just from that. I mean, what? I don't know. That should be worth more to me. I don't know why that's not worth as much. Or, I don't know why that's not worth more. I mean, even for four, that's not too bad. I don't know. Tell me what's going on there, guys. What am I missing? I gotta be missing something. Face shield. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, thought that was a misprint. Nope. Flare of the hate bound. That's cool as devils up in here with undying. It's legit. Chosen of Malakov. All right. I love it, love it. Yeah, tell me what's going on with that one card. I'm not sure what to make of that. I think it sounds like a great card, that Hellrider. But then again, I could be wrong. Maybe it's not a good card. It sounds good. Maybe I should make a deck around it. I don't know. We'll see. I do have a lot of deck ideas I want to start putting together. Alpha Brawl. Boom, boom, boom. 
Target creature an opponent controls deals damage equal to its power to each other creature that player controls. Then each other creature deals damage equal to its power. Okay, that's just kind of chaotic. Too much chaos for me there, pal. I like to keep things simple. Because when you start making things all complex, they either become stressful, and that leads to no fun, or they become tainted. No one likes taints. I guess, yeah, everyone's got a fetish. Oh, I want that card in foil. Why am I pulling so many of those? It's like there's not that many cards in this set. How many cards were in this set? Could someone tell me about this awesome bulk we just pulled? Um, how many cards are in this set? Because it doesn't seem like many. I've already pulled like four of the same card, and I feel like I'm a little more than halfway through. So what is going on there? Someone please shed some light on that. All right, here we go, baby. Here we go. Meow. A lot of kitties in here. Vault of Archangel. Fuck yeah. I was just talking about this card. So this is the card I mentioned. Uh, shit, I mentioned it somewhere. Let me just read what the fuck it does. Vault of the Archangel. Creatures you control gain death touch and life link until end of turn. That's badass. That's badass. Make a deck around that. I'm well, not around it, but you can make a deck and include that. That is a sweet-ass card, though. I don't care what your mama says. I don't care what your girlfriend says. I don't care what your daddy says. I don't care what your teacher says. That is a sweet card. Just to let you know. Heavy Maddock. That is a very terrible card. Thought you'd like to know. Deranged Outcast. Nope. Probably not worse yet. Chosen of Malkov. A little 4-4 four, four on the back side. Cuckoo. Do you guys like using flip cards? Because I would feel like that messes with the sleeves and everything. I literally wouldn't like using flip cards. Lingering Souls is sweet. Increasing ambition. Did we already pull one of those? What's going on here? What is going on here, Soul Caesar? Sizer? Soul, Soul Caesar. Soul Caesar. Soul Sizer. Soul Caesar. Sorcesses. I need to pull some damn awesome zombies, like right now. I need I need a good zombie right now. I'm not settling for anything less than a good zombie. Grim Backwoods, what the fuck kind of shit is this? They, okay, that's it. I don't, I'm, I'm not liking the way this is going, guys. I'm not liking the way this is going right now. I'm not... I need a zombie. I need a sweet-ass zombie. Dark Ascension, I don't have to buy you again. You better spring back to life right now. I need a sweet-ass zombie. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Another Emmerwolf. Predator Ooze, what is this shit? What is this shit? All right, that's it. That's it. Why, why would I get too... Uh, that's repeating bulk. That doesn't happen normally. I don't like repeating bulk. Do you guys like repeating bulk? How would you feel if you were me right now? You just dropped the big 115 on this booster box, only to discover Geralt's messenger all up in that ass. <laughs> There's a sweet zombie. He's like five bucks. Hell yeah! One of the uh, the punks. One of that punks in my zombie deck. Geralt's Messenger enters the battlefield. When Geralt's Messenger enters the battlefield, target opponent loses two life. Undying. Pretty nasty card. He, that card rocked. Uh, rocked the fucking competitive market for a while there. Uh, it, it definitely did its damage. Well, let me tell you, I'm pretty sure it was banned for a short while as well. Pretty sure it was banned. I could be wrong, but I doubt it. I think I mentioned this in one video, and someone's like, you're wrong, it wasn't banned, but then, like, no one else would argue that point. I don't know if I responded to that guy. Gravecrawler, fuck yeah, back to back, pimping ass, taking hoe ass, getting high ass, smoking ass, KY jelly packing ass, motherfucking zombies up in here. Guys, I am loving it. I am loving it. And another soul sizer. If we get one more of those, I mean, we're going to have, like, seven, so that's fun. Not really. But hey, this pack, or this box is picked up. What do you say about that? Those two little pools were pretty nice. Let's see if we can keep that going. Give me a Fires of Undeath. That's all I want. Call to the Kindred. 
call to the king druid. Cool, cool. Scorned Villager. I feel like I see Scorned Villager like every two packs or something. I don't know. This has to be a very like smaller set, right? Like what they make like 210 cards or something? I mean this seems kind of limited. Maybe less than that. I don't think there is 210 cards in here. It's gotta be like one like high 180 or 170. Something like that. I don't know. Someone let me know. Oh, we got another mythic. Drag Skull, uh, Drag Skull Reaver, flying double strike lifelink whenever you gain life, draw a card. That's kind of cool. Oh, see? How many times have I seen that little sh Shamuta? Not friendly Shamuta. All right, let's keep it going, baby. Oh, shit, I hope I don't lose, uh, lose space right now. That would really suck. All right, come on. I got I to gotta speed it up. And if I do, I'll just have to splice the videos together. Immerwolf. Fiend of the Shadows, badass. Damn! A flip? Fuck yeah, look at that shit. Equip creature gets plus one plus zero when equip creature deals combat damage to a player. Untach Elbrus, the binding blade, then transform it. Fuck yeah, that is sick. Fuck yeah. Flying Intimidate and Trample, whenever a player loses the game, put 13 plus one plus one counters. Oh my god. Use that shit in Commander. Fuck. That's what you want to do, kids. You want to use that shit in Commander. That card right there. Bam. Commander, that shit. Throw that up in the EDH deck. Get some of that, son. That is cool. Probably a cheap card, too, I bet. Probably, like, under five bucks. It's just beast mode. Gotta love throwing those crazy-ass beasts up in there. Markov Blade Master, double strike. Can't go over everything here, guys. But there it is. There it is. Pause it up if you need to. We are running out of space. Oh, please don't run out of space, baby. Ah, open up. You are killing time right now in space by not opening. There we go. Hopefully something nasty will come. Burning Oil, Requiem Angel. Something, something. And that is it. Chalice of Life. Cool, cool. Don't know why I put that Chalice of Life over there. You may make your assumptions. Go! What else are we going to get? That pack opened up nice for me. Damn, look at that. Another freaking uh, mythic. Fuck, just knocked over my common stack. Not cool, not cool. Hell of all, exile target creature you control, exile target creature you don't control. When Hell of all is put into a grave from the battlefield, return all cards exiled with its own battlefield. That's pretty cool. Remember, we're speeding it up here. Down to four packs. Can I do it? We are down to four packs, babe. Come on, whoops. Oh, I thought that was something else. Zombie apocalypse foil right there. Hell yeah. That's cool, though. We are going backwards in time here. Bam. Uh, increasing confusion. Tons of it. Not even looking at the rest of the shit. Maybe we will. A little, little, little snipper. All right, there we go. I'm done with that. Keeping it going. Don't be a groupie. Keep it moving, Shouty. You know me. Here we go. Three packs. Ah! Why won't you open nicely? Someone's like, Joey Moss, I, I would never let you open my packs. You are crazy, guy. You are crazy. You would damage all the cards before I got to open them. Hellrider again. See, all these, uh, all these, um, repeats. That's like the, uh, what, third repeat? What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Down to two packs. Uh, that's like the third or fourth card we had that was a repeat. So, interesting. I still want that one card in foil. Bam! Ghoul Tree 1010, Zombie Tree Folk. Ghoul Tree costs one less to cast for each card in your graveyard. Too bad, just a big freaking bleh. Doesn't have any other abilities except for that. That's not really ability. Just lessening the casting cost. All right, last pack. What do you guys think? Did you like this Dark uh, Ascension box? Please let me know. What was your favorite card in here? Alpha Brawl. Definitely not that. Wolf Bitten Captive. That's cool. And a Foil Boosh. Tracker's Instincts. Nice. Well, at least we went out there kind of fun. I did not get the big pool I wanted, but I did get five Mythics. That was awesome. And as always, guys, peace, love, and anal.